All right, Pisces. Hey, this is going to be your reading, your March reading for you and your person. Let's start with an Oracle card, and then we're going to go from there. Let's see, what's the message for Pisces and Pisces person? This angle's better with the table and everything, right? There it is. <clears throat> Be supportive. Make a genuine effort to show you care. You know, sometimes we overthink things. All you really gotta do sometimes is just show up and sh like be there for the person. You don't really gotta say much or do something. You don't always have to be doing something, you know? Your person gets vibrations just from you being around. You don't always have to do anything. You don't always have to say anything. Showing someone you care is there. And you guys want to keep it light with some kind of passionate messaging. Okay, let me get three cards about Pisces. Three cards about Pisces person. And this would be the state of affairs. Past, present, possible future. Alright? Possible outcome. And then maybe some questions on what is going on, right? Okay, let me get three cards for my Pisces march towards their person. What was the story? Storyline. Let's see. What was the storyline? <clears throat> the world reverse. Three of swords reverse. Five of Cups reverse in the near future. Aha. Uh -huh. Oh. Oh man. Uh, it's this. Hold on, wait. Okay. Bottom of the deck, I'm seeing the Emperor, the Ten of Cups, and the Ten of Swords. Ten of Pentacles reverse. You're putting your foot down, Pisces. Or that could be your person. The jig is up. In your recent past, you felt stuck with a situation. The world reverse. You didn't feel forward movement in something, and you were left with more questions than answers. You didn't even know where to start getting started in your recent past concerning your person. And your person acted like they didn't even care about it. They were acting like they had all like a whole major fanfare going on. They felt like all eyes on them. Maybe they felt more important than you when you were down in the dumps. It seemed like you maybe wanted to make things work out and they were only mo focused on themselves and maybe validation from others. It could be that uh, your person was looking for new things to keep themselves busy, while, whereas you kept thinking about the situation and were stuck in it. The present situation, I think there was, there was a third party involved. It seemed that you're not heartbroken over this anymore. Maybe your person wants to try again with you. They may be coming at you to try to mend things with the relationship uh, equally. Maybe they just, you know, agree to want to be friends anymore uh, forever on. And you, at, on the other hand, you're over it. You feel like your heart's not broken anymore. It seems like something happened between you and your person concerning a third party energy or something to do with people being too busy for each other. Something to do with not fitting in together anymore for some reason. The possible outcome here for you Pisces is you're over it. You're going to be over it. You're going to only look towards the future and you've learned from the situation and you're gonna carry on. You're not gonna really stay battered up and beaten, right Pisces? And your person's outcome here is they may still end up confused over options. It's like their life is on grayscale right now. But they're kind of trying to go in any direction that'll take them or maybe they are examining their choices. But they're confused. They really are confused. Alright, let's dive in a little deep. But both of you, how you're feeling is you, the theme of this reading is to be supportive of each other and you both want to reach out. But you don't know how and you're both thinking of maybe only sexual things to reach out you don't even know maybe you want to hang out something small but 
you don't really know how to approach um, it. Okay, page of one's Kai Fried, but the seven of pentacles. Let me get another card. You both are waiting on each other. You both are waiting for each other's message and you both are beating yourselves up. Nine of cups reverse. Or maybe it's just you Pisces, but nah, I'm seeing it's both of you. Both of you are doing something unhealthy to get your mind off the other. Okay. Clarify the Five of Cups reverse. What can Pisces expect in their near future that will help them look more towards the future? Five of Pentacles reverse. Okay, you've already examined, okay, how this person made you feel abandoned. You've already done the self-work. You're over that. You're over the planning and you know that, okay, I'm just going to focus on saving my money and building towards the future instead of feeling abandoned and feeling sorry for myself and letting another person be, have power over my stability, my future. Like, you know, sometimes when we get into a relationship, sometimes it's too fast and we don't think about how much the other person also weighs our priorities. You know what I mean? Okay, clarify the Seven of Cups. What will Pisces person possibly do in the future regarding their options? Clarify the Seven of Cups. The Chariot. They're out of fear. There are pro possibly secrets are gonna come out and this person is going to go towards a new thing. A brand new thing, Cancerian energy. It could be a brand new thing or it could be Coming back to this with full force. Let's, let's actually find out. Temperance right now. Both of you are called to do have temperance for the matter. Clarify the chariot. Is this with, Pi is, could this be with Pisces or Pisces person? No. Two of Wands reverse. It seems like the person is still in indecision about who to choose or what to choose, but they're just going head first into anything new. This doesn't always have to be a relationship, yeah? It could be going back to work. It could be starting a new project. It could be Facing their fears, you know, like taking life by the balls and not being scared to do that. Like this is how your person's feeling. And it isn't really toward a person because as we can see, they're still indecisive. Okay, Pisces. Love you. Bye.